Hello everyone, so today I have received uh, my budget TV box from China. It was packed in uh, a plastic bag and wrapped. So I was a little skeptical of whether it has survived properly or not. Whereas, uh, I'm just doing a quick unboxing here. So to show you the condition of the box, uh, while it was shipped from China to India, it has taken a little bit of beating. But I think the contents are fine. So we have the TV box right here which is the Tynex TX2 in addition to this I have also got this UK plug I don't know why but I don't need it in India if you open up the box if you open up the box we've got uh, the other uh, accessories so I have received an adapter and as you can see it's a I'm sorry as you can see it's a UK style travel adapter so that means it will work perfectly with um, here in India as well I have received an HDMI cable and I have also received a remote so let me just remove this out of this packaging So this is all that I have received in the package. Okay, this is the remote. So let me take it out of its plastic casing. So pretty small remote. I didn't expect it to be this size. And yes, it does not come with any batteries, but I guess it is going to take two AAA batteries. Okay, so that's that and uh, this is also uh, and coming now to the actual device so this is the Tanex TX2 it's 2 gigs of RAM it's got a rock chip uh, CPU quad core CPU 1.5 gigahertz um, let's look at the ports that it has Okay, so it has one Ethernet at the back. It has an Ethernet port, an HDMI port, the power socket, as well as an AV socket for other analog position or analog uh, cables. It this cable was not included in this package though. It has two USB ports along with a micro SD card slot, and in the front there's absolutely nothing. So I will use this particular device. And I will come up with a, a detailed review. This for now is just an unboxing. It took me approximately 20 days to arrive and it came through registered uh, mail or post. And I'm pretty happy with how it was delivered. So far no damage to any of the equipment except for a little bit in, on the box. And yes one more thing I missed was it comes with a very basic instruction manual which I don't think anyone would need if they have connected any device to their TV through an HDMI cable before. Anyway, that's about it. So thank you everyone for watching this particular video and see you in the next one. Thank you very much.